I never thought I'd say this, but I reckon Lisa Fernandez may just have met her match this morning. Let's check out where she is. She's about to go head to head with one of Perth's toughest ladies. Oh, let me tell you about Erin McGowan, all right? I want her on everyone's radar this morning. Erin McGowan is a Perth girl. She's a former world WBO champion, OK? And what's happening on Friday, Tim, is that she's taking on some uh, some chick called Arlene, all right, in a world title fight right here in Perth. So I'm going to have a chat with Erin. Look, I'll be honest with you, I, I love boxing because I you know, just do it down at the gym for some fitness myself. Didn't know about Erin, but she's a Perth girl that we can all be really proud of because she's achieved so much in the female boxing world and she is an absolute champion. World title, check her out. So I bought my pink Everlast gloves. <laughs> where I do, the, my gloves where I do blind her with some fluoro pink gloves. It might be your only tactic. That could be you, that, uh, that boxing bag behind you, that could be you soon. No, no, wait, wait. Tim. <laughs> But what she goes, I said, oh, look, don't, don't go too hard, you know, because you've got a world title fight on Friday. She goes, don't worry, I'm just chatting. <laughs> <laughs> and the camel, the camel almost that. fell over. <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. See you soon. Happy for right, the last time. Soon. Fernandez spends a lot of time on her phone. You've sent about four million tweets in your time, haven't you, Lisa? But it's a different kind of physical danger that you're about to face this morning. Yeah, actually, I tweeted last night about this and said, if I was going to take on Erin, like, whose money would, where would you put your money? Well, look I, I, look, I do like an underdog lease, but, you know, I don't like to lose <laughs> as well. So <laughs> Good on you. I'm going right, to take a safe bet here. And, and I know you are, you, Lisa, Aaron. the flying fist Thank Fernandez, you. but I'm going to go with the favourite this time. OK, now listen, Erin McGowan is uh, someone who I want everyone to know in Perth because she's a world title champion and she's a Perth girl. Morning, Erin. Good morning. You, you have a world title fight this Friday against Arlene Blanco, blah, 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 whatever. We'll get onto her later. <laughs> Tell us how you got into boxing. I'm so intrigued by this story. Oh, you know, I played a lot of competitive sport when yes. I was younger. I was probably a little bit too competitive. Yeah. I had my son quite young, yes. lost my health and fitness for a bit there and was determined to get fit and healthy again. And boxing was probably one of the hardest things I would had to do at yeah. that point. Um, and, you know, at the end of the day, you've only got yourself yeah. in there. I wasn't much of a team player. Now, yeah, but hang on a minute. I've boxed, right? I do a bit of box fit. <laughs> when did you know? When did you know that you were actually really good at it? When they went, uh, oh, hang on. This well, chick's got it. Initially, yeah. I didn't want to get punched in the head yeah. when I very first started. Yeah. And um, the trainers down there wanted me to fight. And I was like, yeah. I don't want to get punched in the head. Yeah. And I had a sparring session with a couple of the younger boys that beat up on me a little bit. Yeah. And I was like... Hey, I'll be back tomorrow to spy you boys again. <laughs> and I just, my competitive streak override. And then I had my first fight and um, I beat the state champ and it sort yeah. of all just went from there. Now, Erin uh, McGowan, Erin McGowan, Erin McGowan, remember her name. Erin's actually play uh, fought overseas in uh, one of the biggest boxing nations in the world, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, I fought for the WBC. Um, in South America, actually, which is a pretty, pretty scary country to go yeah. and fight when you've got the whole world against you. And absolutely won that fight and didn't get the decision, which caused a lot of controversy around the world. And the WBC ordered oh. it a rematch and things like wow. that. So, um, and then I fought in Belgium for the IBF, another huge world title. Wow! But, um, Look at you, and you're a Perth girl. I love it. Now you got a 16 year old son. Yes. Well, he's 16 now. Yep. So, like, you you could. You actually could bash him up, couldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> like, if I had to. Now, okay, so just do a scenario with me. You're in the house and you go, hey, tidy your room. And what if he smart mouths you? What, like, has he ever done that? Uh, yeah, he's a 16 year old boy, so he definitely tries his luck, but I think he knows when he pushes it to the yeah. limit, he gets the look and he's like, <laughs> Okay, Mum. Okay. And, and he'll, he'll back down and go Show do what he's got. But he's Show us the look. Tim wants to see the look. What's the look? <laughs> yeah, yeah, she did the look. Yeah. I'm, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's the look. Yeah. yeah okay. You don't want to mess yeah. with that. Feeling okay. it. <laughs> he feels it. Okay, Erin, listen. I want you to teach me just a couple of boxing moves next in the 8.30. Yeah, sure. And while we do that, boxing moves I'm going to learn from a world champion. No, I'm not saying that I want to punch anyone's head in at Channel 9, but um, there are a couple <laughs> of people that later. could do with a punch in the face, all right? So um, I'll show you a good, a good move. Then. All right, you show me a good move. We'll be back at 8.30 and we'll talk more about the world title fight, which is happening on Friday night. Uh, world title she's going for and we want to get everyone behind her. Erin McGowan, Perth girl, world title. I'll be back at 8.30, Tim, with moves you wouldn't believe. And we'll see you then, is guys. the cat fight on? <laughs> Can we start calling it? Is the cat fight happening? Tim wants to go, is the cat fight happening? Like that? Cat fight? Yeah, that's Tim. With Tim. We'll just come back and get Tim. Yeah, Tim, it's happening. All right, we're going to go. I'll be back with the weather. Tim, you're going to get shortly. a cat fight. Yeah, I know. I've got to be careful. Thank you.
Back to Elisa, the Flying Fist. Fernandez now for all the weather details. I think, I think she heard you say Flying Fist, so she's a bit worried. So she's actually yeah, practicing. Yeah, she's getting a little bit of practice in. Yeah, yeah. have a look. Yeah. Currently in the city, it's 19.3. <laughs> 33 degrees we should be getting by Tuesday. So uh, That's if you're still alive I'm here then, with the world with the, with the world champion. Um, boxing behind me. Catch you at 8.30 with some actual moves and we'll see if we can go mono a e mono. Or is that a basketball term? No, that's all right. I can do that. One on one? Yeah, that'll do. Thank you, Lisa. We'll see you then. Don't forget our special report. Let's check in with our very own Rocky. The Flying Fist Fernandez. Uh, Lise, you're all gloved up, ready to go. Can I ask, um, have you sorted out some temporary care for your lovely daughter and your dog, just in case the unthinkable happens here? Certainly have. They're coming to your place. <laughs> OK, so here's the thing. Erin McGowan, right? She's behind me in the ring. She's pretty amazing. She's a Perth girl. She's vying for her world, world title fight. It's happening this Friday against Arlene The Anger Blenko. Is it The Anger? Anger Fist. What a stupid name. Sorry, Arlene. <laughs> All right. OK, oh, what am I doing? I'm trash talking. Has she hired like you a, as her personal trash talker, has she? <laughs> I am so for it. Anyway, we're, I, I've learned a move, OK? I have been taught a couple of boxing moves. We're going to find out about this world title fight, what it means. Find out about Erin McGowan, a little bit more Perth girl who's done good. Look at her. She's amazing. I'm so impressed, Tim. I've not... I'm, I'm just... I'm sold. I'm absolutely sold. And it's a big fight and we want to get behind her, Perth. Yep. So more to come on this from me shortly in about five minutes. And no Arlene, if you're watching, I'll be with you know, sorry about that. Thank you, Lise. We'll see well, you soon. <laughs> Go back to Lisa Fernandez now, and the time is almost nigh. Lise, the gloves are on. Yep, the gloves are, are on, Tim. We're in the ring. OK, well, let me just let me just tell you a little bit about Erin McGowan, firstly. She's a Perth girl, done really good in the boxing world. Her nickname, I just found out, is Erin uh, the Blueprint McGowan. Yeah, what's that about? That... Can you answer? Erin, what, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you explain to Tim. Um, yeah, I was given that nickname for, through the media, from, mainly from a ring announcer. Just, he, you know, he feels that I was the blueprint of female boxing and I put... Uh, female boxers in Australia on the world map, so that name kind of just stuck with and me. And look from at her, she's nice. so modest. She doesn't want to say it, but you know, like she really has. And I love the fact that Erin's from Perth. So here, here we go, Tim. Just wait. Erin's showing me a couple of moves. So Erin, th this right. is what. Okay. Well, how do when I, do I teach it? some yeah. of the girls some boxing yes. fitness, I teach them number one thing: yes. get their hands up so their jaws yes. nice and safe. That's yep. where you get knocked okay. out. Yep. So we want to have a nice yep. tight defense. You're going to throw a left, right yep. at me. Left. left. Right, slip, come. and come back with a power hand. Okay. So you throw left, right, okay. slip, I'm right, ready, I'm ready. really yep. come back with that right okay. hand. Left, right, slip. Yeah, good girl. Oh, nice. Okay. Hands up, yeah. elbows in to protect oh, your wrist. Oh, I almost got her. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> left, right, slip, right. Good girl. Hands up. That's it. Oh, elbows okay, in. so I'm, what I'm doing right now is Look I'm pretending that you're feet. Tim. Yeah, and feet. Nice. <laughs> I'm pretending that you're Tim, okay? Right ready? Then, you're right. Tim now. What would you say? Left, right, slip. Yeah. What would you say? That Okay. Tim. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Good girl, nice. Nice okay. tight fist so we don't hurt your hand. Left, right, slip, right. Good girl. Now, Erin, tell me. Let's get serious now. Let's talk about this fight. Tell yeah. me about this chick. Arlene What's going to happen? Yeah. Look, it's a big world title fight. Yep. I'm expecting 10 tough rounds. Yep. She's naturally a bigger, stronger yes. girl yep. um, at her weight, but she's coming down. Yeah to meet me halfway. Yep. So she's coming down the weight, she's got to cut the weight and I've got to put on a little bit of weight. Yep. So I'm stepping up from super featherweight to lightweight and yep. she's coming down from light welter. So we're meeting halfway. Yep. Um, you know, the plan for me is to just box smart, yep. do what I, I do. Yep. I've got 13 years of international fight experience yep. which I need to take into the ring with me on Friday night. Yep. Do you guys trash talk? Uh, I, don't do like, like... I don't like to trash talk, a lot Oops. of fighters do. But no, no, that's just me. I don't mind other people Good doing thing it. You're that's there then, completely yeah. fine. I just generally, yep. I yep. like to just focus on what I've yes. got to do in there. Yes. And um, yep. if I start focusing on yep. trash talking her, that's yep. taking my mind away from the job that I've got to complete. Yeah. Well, because uh, well, I'm kind of glad that you said that because the only uh, like I can only think of one word that remind that rhymes with Blenko, and it's not a really nice one. So I guess we don't really want to go there. <laughs> Blenko, you are no, we won't do it. Okay, so uh, Italian club, we're going to let you know uh, on the screen how you can get tickets to your bout if you want to see this. It is a world title fight yeah. happening, and just like that was really. Um, 
um, you get really puffed out. All right, now, so just say we were in a fight. Yeah. What? What's your move? What's your knockout move? Like, what? How would you do oh, it? Oh, Lisa, if we were going to, I wouldn't want to hurt your pretty little no, face. I can't. So I'd probably get your hands. Up. <laughs> <laughs> trick you with the There's the trash oh, talking. On the body. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, and then how would I defend myself against that? Oh, if you knew, if you were quick yeah. enough, you'd yeah. block. Yeah. You'd drop down and block to the body. Okay, so you'd so go do, do it again. Put so your hands up nice yeah. and high. Up, yeah. Up, up, yeah. That's so you're gonna block oh. and then. Drop your elbows to block. Yeah, yeah so, so. So, how would oh. I get you? Um, maybe yeah. when I go to the body, yeah. throw a left hook at my head, maybe. Oh, yeah. okay, we're going to practice some so of these moves. So, you're always look, looking for openings. You're tricking yeah. your opponent. Yeah. You want them to open up so you can yeah. attack on that <laughs> opening. Oh. Yeah. Tim is laughing in the studio. <laughs> what he doesn't know is that I'm bringing these boxing gloves back for that move. Big guy? For that big right hand. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm still trying right. to work out what rhymes with Blanco. And guys, Blanco. you can get tickets online with CDL promotions <laughs> yes. or CDL boxing. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, yeah. what well, rhymes with Blanco starts with an H. Anyway, I'm going to be back <laughs> uh, with the weather shortly. Erin McGowan, Erin McGowan, get behind it. She's a world champ from Perth. Back Good to on you, Liz. Guys. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you shortly. There could be a bit more rain on the way. We'll have all the details straight after the break. See you soon. <laughs> Let's go back to Lisa Fernandez for all the weather details. Lisa, you've survived. Congratulations. Thanks very much. I do know how to box a little bit. No, actually, I don't. She was very kind, Erin McGowan, world champion. I do. I'm a good trash talker. I think she's taking me into the ring just for that. 20.9 degrees we are in the city right now. So, uh, from me here, I just want to say thanks for having us this morning. Great to meet Erin. Uh, even if you're not into boxing, I tell you right now, what she's achieved is pretty phenomenal for a Perth girl. We should all be really proud of her. Erin McGowan. She is taking on Arlene blah, 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 Blanco uh, <laughs> this Friday night at the Italian Club. So I, I've just been informed fight, what, what rhymes with Blanco now. Stuff. It took, a, took, took you a while. Well, it I was thinking of something that rhymed both while. syllables and, you know, I was racking my brain. I couldn't... Anyway. Mm, it's right, just the second the syllable. Station. Anyway, that, with the too much on. away. Too much away. <laughs> All well, right. congratulations on surviving. Tomorrow. Thanks, Liz. We'll see you tomorrow.